Good afternoon guys, it's John Panella, your travel vlogger. Sadly, this afternoon we would not be able to go on an adventure because of COVID-19. But the good news is, I would still be able to describe, interpret, criticize, and analyze an artwork which is, as you may have guessed, is actually that big one up there at the back. And I'm actually inside my bedroom right now. So, I actually have other artworks, but since we do not have an author for that beautiful butterfly collection, so I picked this one. Now, another reason why I picked this artwork is because it is very meaningful to me and my family as it was given to us by a family friend. And taking a closer look, it is actually made in Australia. Arlunia is the company and it's entitled Nawala Dreaming. Proudly Australian made. You can take a closer look. And I would be posting a picture for you to be able to zoom in right now. Now moving forward, this is actually a Churinga Aboriginal designed tea towel called Nawala Dreaming. These Australian made tea towels are cut, soon designed, and printed in Australia. They are made from 100% linen, and Aboriginal designs are licensed from Aboriginal artists. Aboriginal artists are the native people of Australia. Tea towels are the perfect souvenir to take home to someone as a gift for the traveler themselves or as a reminder of their trip. The size is actually 800 millimeters by 470 millimeters. The word dreaming is often used by Aborigines to describe the relations and balance between the spiritual, natural, and moral elements of the world. This design is also available on a canvas apron. For our version, it is placed in a picture frame and it's actually a towel. In my opinion, the design itself complements its purpose as a towel. As you can see, it actually showcases the rich and vast number of aquatic animals that Australia possesses. We have turtles, fishes. Moving forward, I would also like to commend how intricately made it was as it was actually handmade so much effort was placed into this quite big piece of artwork i would also like to explain its elements so we have horizontal lines vertical lines curved lines and diagonal lines for the horizontal lines it actually means serenity calmness repose for vertical lines, we have dignity, strength, action. For diagonal lines, we have movement, animation. And of course, for the curved lines, which is present all throughout the artwork, is grace and movement as well. For the color, it is actually very simple and plain when you look at it, as it only used a few colors but it's very pleasing to the eye with how the design was made in such a way that the colors actually complement each other it is very pleasing to the eyes starting off with the use of black which actually means farewell blue that is actually very dark blue there intelligence and competence and then we also have brown, which is an earth tone, representing where all of these creatures actually once crawled or are currently living at. And of course, the color white, which represents purity. So all in all, the artwork is actually very beautiful. It possesses a feeling that it's very light to look at. You wouldn't see negativity. There is excitement as well as even if the colors are just very simple. You can see how impressive the finished output actually is. That's about it for this afternoon guys and I will see you again next time. Bye! I wanna be, I wanna be you.
Oh, 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 oh,